Hello the kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of New Vegas. Alright, when we left off, we had just kind of dishonested our way into the uh, Hidden Valley base for the Brotherhood of Steel. Technically, it's dishonest because we didn't say we're with Veronica, but we're not pretending to be Veronica, which is the main thing... That keeps us from being completely dishonest in this case. So, I mean, there's that. Alright. Let's just do this. Get in here now. And get yelled at, because we weren't supposed to be here. I can guarantee it. Hi there! Listen up. I'm in charge of security around here. And I can't say I'm too happy about having an outsider waltzing around. Yeah. But since you came in with Veronica, mm -hmm. I'm inclined to cut you a little slack. Thank you. Just behave yourself, and we won't have any problems, okay? Well, thank you. And the elder's going to want to talk to you. He's on the second level. Oh, okay. Just take a right once you get down there. My office is right here in case you need anything. Just ask for Ramos. Ask for Ramos. Alrighty. Well. Quest S. Okay, still in the dark. Okay. It was just taking a while to load in the rest of the quest name. Okay. Hey, we made contact with the Brotherhood of Steel. Alright, so... You made it in. Thank you, Veronica, for helping me. In that regard. I think I hear bullets going off. Or rather, Goss rifles going off. Are they... Huh. Sounds like they're... Is there a test? Is there a firing range? Oh, I guess I'm supposed to go in there. All right. Not able to tell what the sound was, so that kind of makes it difficult. But hey, I'll eventually find out, I'm sure. All right, let's go talk to the Elder, huh? Hi there. Um... Oh, you're holding a regular rif uh, laser rifle. This guy gets the Gauss rifle. You kind of get shafted with the laser rifle. Oh, someone might be a little jealous. Okay. Hi there. When Paladin Ramos informed me that Veronica was approaching with an outsider in tow. At first, I didn't know what to think. Oh, yeah? After giving the matter some thought, however, I've decided that an outsider could be of use to me right now. Really? However, I will not force you to help us. Should you refuse, you will be allowed to leave here. Though you'd remain Veronica's responsibility. I see. What do you say, outsider? Are you willing to help us? Yeah, sure, why not? I mean, considering I... It sounds like I have no choice other than to make Veronica deal with all of it. If I don't do it... Sure, let's help you. Then allow me to explain our situation. This bunker is currently locked down, allowing no entry or exit with you being one of the few exceptions. I see. In exceptional cases, teams are sent out to investigate sites or retrieve materials deemed too important to ignore. Okay. Three such teams have gone missing recently, and the news of their disappearance has not yet been widely spread to avoid undue concern. I see. In All order right. to maintain the peace and adhere to the strictures of the lockdown, I need to send someone else to discover what happened to them. So that would mean me. Looking for your guys who decided to go AWOL, maybe? Or they just got shot in the face? Which it would be difficult, considering they're wearing power armor. So, there's that. Um, yeah, I'll, surely you have people better suited to looking for them than me. The less who are aware of this situation, the better. I see. My brothers and sisters were deeply traumatized by the losses we incurred several years ago. Yeah, I, I it bet. It would be imprudent to worry them unduly without first discovering the facts of the situation. Fair enough. That, that definitely wouldn't help at all. Okay, sure. I'll begin looking. I'm glad I can count on you. Thank you. Oh, and one other thing. The hmm. patrols each had a holotape detailing their missions that you can use to track them. Okay. The shielding of the bunker prevents us from actively tracking them. Okay, fair enough. But their enough. positions should show up on your map once you get to the surface. Cool. Should our worst fears become realized, please bring back all three of the holotapes from the patrols. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, bring our brothers home. 
Will do. I've given the order that you be given access to some of the equipment our scouts and patrols have scavenged over the years. Hey! You won't be allowed to purchase any prohibited equipment, but hopefully mm. some of what's available will prove useful to you. Fair enough. I mean, hey. You can't let me have all of it, but I mean, some of it's fine. Some of it's better than nothing. Okay, Repcon HQ, Nellis Air Force Base, and Black Mountain. I guess I'm not allowed through that door. Okay. Well then, uh, let's not do the door that'll piss them off. So, you're the outsider that's been given leave to wander around freely. Yeah, kind of. Desperate times call for desperate measures, I guess. Okay. My name's Harden. I'm the head paladin of this chapter. Okay. And I think we might be able to help each other out. How so? I don't know what the Elder talked to you about, but I can tell you this chapter is in trouble. And he's at the center of it. Oh? Are you willing to listen to what I have to say? Why should I trust you? Why should you trust the Elder? Okay. I recommend listening to both of us and choosing whom to trust for yourself. All right. So are you willing to listen? All right, go ahead. Let me listen. As you may have already heard, this entire base is under a state of lockdown. Mm -hmm. No one goes out except small patrols at night. Yeah. Most of the chapter has been sealed in here for years. And those few who are outside when the lockdown was initiated are forbidden from returning. Oh. Morale has plummeted as time has gone by. And many of our current paladins haven't seen combat outside of training simulations. All right. And all because of the Elder's explicit order that no one be allowed in or out. The only way things will change is if a new Elder is installed. A new Elder like you? What about Veronica? She seems to come and go as she pleases. Veronica's a special case. She handles the procurement of supplies. If we didn't let her and those like her back in, we'd all starve. Okay. If the Elder could manage it, he'd shut them out as well. And all in the name of security. Which is why we need to replace him. Uh, have you tried bringing this up with him yourself? Of course I have. Many times, in fact. The Elder has an open-door policy and will listen to advice on any subject save this one. I see. He refuses to see that our isolation is slowly weakening us. Aside from being our duty... Going out on missions is what kept us strong. Mm -hmm. And because he fails to see that, he must be replaced. And I suppose you'd nominate yourself. I would. I'm the senior most paladin in the chapter, and have more combat experience than any two others here put together. Okay. I'd gladly support another candidate, but no one has the courage to step forward and make the attempt. So it falls to me. I would put this chapter back on the right path if I could just assume leadership. Right. How do you propose to do that? I don't know. I've gone through our records dozens of times looking for a precedent regarding the dismissal of an elder and come up with nothing. I see. The people who are most likely to know how it could be done are also some of McNamara's strongest supporters. So they refuse to help me. Uh, of course. Which is why we're having this conversation. An outsider such as yourself would arouse less suspicion asking questions about such matters. Uh, the fact okay. that the elder has I some see. tasks for you means his faithful won't suspect you. And you have a line open to the man himself. In short, you're in a perfect position to help me. Will you at least think about it? What do I get out of helping you? Because, quite frankly, this seems like... Uh, this seems pretty shady. If I become elder, the lockdown will be lifted. And we'll once again be able to send patrols out into the wastes. We'll become powerful again. Mm. When that happens, it will be good to have the Brotherhood as an ally. Good enough? I I kind of don't want to part in this. I, I'm pretty sure working with McNamara... I think that's how you pronounce his name. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure that'll get him on my good side anyway, or get me on his good side, rather. So... I don't think doing this is going to bode well for that. So, I'm going to say no. I want no part in this. I half expected you to say that. In which case, I'll continue to pursue the matter on my own. Should you continue dealing with the Elder and find yourself beginning to see my point of view, I'll be around. Okay. Well, at least he keeps it open. Alright. Brotherhood Scribes. I guess we got a couple of those around. Right about Ibsen. That's that's a path we could take. Alright, let's get back uh let's get back up to the surface, huh?
Considering that's where we're supposed to be going, I guess. I guess. I don't know. Honestly. Oh, I see. There's a bottom level. Oops, hey. sorry. Hi there. Um, your brotherhood scribe. That's about it. Okay. <laughs> they just have pinion nuts laying on the table. I guess that's the version of the apple given to the teacher. Alright, I guess it must be on the bottom level where this uh, is going on. Maybe. I don't want to see where it is, though. Uh, no, this is not... This is not working out. I'm trying to... F These are just bunks. Damn it. <laughs> Eddie's just phasing through the floor. That's amazing. I just... I just want to see where the fucking... Oh, boy. Alrighty, that was weird. That was a super hard crash. Uh, <laughs> it was so hard of a crash that even me exiting out of it, like booting out of the game, and then rebooting it, still didn't fix it. It had to reset all on its own. It was ridiculous. Okay, well, now that i fixed that kind of want to still find that firing range and I think I was on the right track. I just want to see if it hard crashes the game again. No. It's just a medical area. Hmm. Seems the NCR is making friends. We had reports of them making overtures to some gang in Freeside. Oh yeah. That was kind of my doing. Hey, uh, senior scribe uh, Schuler. Hello, you must be the outsider everyone's talking about. Yes. I'm Linda Schuler. If you ever need medical attention, this is the place to come. Linda Schuler, Quite a name. Uh, so you're a doctor? Yes, I handle all medical needs in the bunker. If you're ever wounded, I can treat you. For a fee. Oh, you have fees. Normally I'd just be the base's medical officer. But my other duties say otherwise. Okay. You mentioned other duties? I'm this bunker's head scribe in everything but name. Oh, I see. I supervise see. the research teams. I collate the reports. I attend the meetings. Oh. But for reasons beyond me, that buffoon Taggart still gets the title. And don't get me started on that little pet of his. Everyone around here knows what's going on there but her. You... why not tell on him? <laughs> okay, uh, you really don't like him, do you? I don't appreciate how much harder I have to work to cover for his tendency to focus on his personal projects. I see. I try not to think too much about his personal proclivities. Oh, you're, uh, you're, you're a little pissed that he's kind of going after his little pet more than anything else. Okay, um, I should ask if, what other services can you we perform? We have equipment here to treat most physical injuries, lacerations, broken bones, that sort of thing. We also carry a full supply of antitoxins. Hmm. You may have noticed the bark scorpions up above. Oh, yeah. Though tiny, their venom packs quite a punch. Mm -hmm. Treating scorpion stings is my most common procedure. Fair enough. I can Fair also enough. treat any form of radiation sickness you pick up out in the waste. No matter what stage. Save the last. Yeah, like me dying. Yeah, that, that's if a little hard to fix. So, uh... Yeah, I don't need anything else out of you. So. Bye. Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you for talking to me. Still breaking hearts there, I see, Scribe Schuler. Alrighty, um, Veronica, um, uh, what was that comment about? Veronica, who the, oh, it's a paladin who's, uh, taking a nap, taking a nappy poo, apparently. Oh, this was where the firing range was. Maybe this was why the crash happened? I heard a special squad of rangers is on its way to the Vegas area. I guess the NCR is finally getting serious about fighting the Leech. Yeah, a little bit, probably. I wonder, can I... Whoa. Knight Torres. The word came down from the Elder that I'm to offer you some of our lesser wares. I see. As if I didn't have other matters on my mind. Like what? Anything I can help you with? If you must know, my inventory check this week shows that our weapon count is one short. Somehow we're missing a laser pistol. Hmm. Harden will have my head if I don't find that weapon soon. I can't delay my report to him any longer. I could look around for it. If you happen to find it, bring it here right away. I might be able to throw a few supplies your way if you do. Fair enough. 
Fair enough. Just Looks missing like a laser pistol, huh? Picture. One less thing for us to deal with. Yeah. Yeah, you to deal with, even though you really shouldn't be dealing with anything. Alright. What's up? Where did you get that iBot? I've never seen one modified quite like that. Well, I mean, that's for a reason, because he's a special boy. Okay, I guess I need to find that laser pistol now, but I have no idea where to look. What the fuck, Veronica? Where the fuck did you go? Or rather, where the fuck did you come from? That was weird. Okay. Um. Hmm. I can't use that door. All right. Um. Where's that laser pistol gonna be? I wonder. Did it go into a fridge? Maybe that'd be something I'd do. Be stupid enough to put it in there while I'm looking for another thing and then forget I put it there. That sounds like something I'd do. Uh, nothing in the garbage can. That's the only other thing I could think of. It being in the garbage can. Hmm. Maybe in here? I don't know. Nothing in the lockers. Alright. That makes sense. How about over here in the classroom? Uh, as much as I'm sick of Taggart's VR sims, I have to admit you wouldn't be combat ready without it. Fair enough. That's that's now fair assessment. The primary components of gunpowder. You don't have any kids in here right now, but be honest here. We got the initiate over here. Um, where am I going to find that laser pistol? Uh, God damn it. Where am I supposed to go to find it? Yeesh. Bathroom. Uh, if it ends up in the bathroom, I'm going to fucking lose my shit. Which would be good because the bathroom's a perfect place to lose your shit. That was a bad joke, even for me. <laughs> that was the worst joke, even for my standards. Yeesh. Okay, well. Just pop these open, because why not? Be a fucking animal. Okay. Where could that laser pistol have gone? Hello. Whoa, hi there. Um, there's a bunch of initiates running around with laser pistols, but... About all I'm seeing. Maybe it went into someone's private quarters, huh? This is not private at all. Might as well have the light on, see if I can see it this way. Nope. Alright, well, let's try it here. Let's try in here. Um. Nothing. Oh, hi there. I didn't see it there. Don't mind me. I was helping. Someone finds stuff. That's all. Okay. Yeesh. Another layer of fucking barracks. And nothing. Okay. Is there... Really, there's nothing. There's no laser pistol whatsoever. I don't... I don't think that... I don't think it's that simple. That it's just a couple laser pistols inside the thing. I don't I don't think it's that simple. It's gotta be one that's missing somewhere else. Oh, this requires a key. Okay. Well. Fuck me, I guess. I might not be able to find it. <laughs> Definitely won't be able to find it this episode, that's for sure. At this rate, I won't be able to find much of anything. Especially if the game crashes on me again. <laughs> oh, that was a hard crash, man. That's fucking... That's not anything. God damn it. How about in here? Ah? Huh? Ah. Uh. No. Damn it. How about in here? Ha-ha! <laughs> 
serious about fighting the Legion. I guess? That's a weird thing just to go up to Veronica to talk about. Aha! No. Okay. Damn it. Damn it! Where the fuck? Huh? Huh? No. Shit. I was hoping. I was hoping so hard. Oh. Someone broke a fucking computer. That's not good. They broke the computer. Okay, well. I am not seeing it anywhere. Not seeing a missing laser pistol of any sort. And quite frankly, I don't know where to look. So, there's that. That doesn't help either. To be perfectly honest, not knowing where to look. So, uh, yeah. That's a try in here, maybe? Let's ask him. Your presence here, let's just say it's highly irregular. Oh, yeah. Outsiders aren't even allowed to know that our bunker's here, let alone come and go freely. Well, yeah. You impressed Elder McNamara, obviously. You must believe that you'd be very useful. So you're head of security? That's right. Nothing gets in or out of here without me knowing it. I see. What are what exactly are the rules regarding that? Under the lockdown, only essential personnel are permitted to enter or leave. That includes supply runners and high security patrols. Ah. All other personnel are forbidden to leave, and any personnel that were out there when the lockdown was enacted are forbidden from returning. Fine by me? Like, is there any... Huh. There's nothing else. Okay. Bye. Guess that's the end of that. Oh, Veronica, you're kind of in the way. Looking sharp, Ramos. Okay, that was weird. All right, didn't expect that. <laughs> Let's get going. So I'm definitely not going to be able to find that laser pistol right now. Not anytime soon. Okay, I might look up where that ended up. Anyway, I'm just going to end the episode here for right now because there's not much else I can do other than look for that stuff for McNamara. So, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to end the episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. Share in comments. We can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat. Playing games and meeting up with the Brotherhood and trying to help them out a little bit. Because that probably would be better for everyone involved. For you.